like 12. I'm starving. I haven't been drinking water or anything. I have that at home right now. Because I have like a bank appointment for like the 100th time. And I'm, yeah. I'm gonna weigh myself in. It's a little later than I usually do, but whatever. Fuck you! Nice. I'm gonna be honest with all of you that gym session was terrible. What happened was I did go to the bank with my mom and the bank really just annoying. It's been annoying but we got whatever we had to get done. Done now finally after so long. I'm just exhausted. I haven't eaten anything. I just had that monster and a bottle of water and I went straight into the workout and it was shit. It was like day. And I'm gonna be transparent. It was terrible and I only did uh, I started with squats and I did um, the leg press and I did another movement. I didn't I only did three movements overall and yeah it was shit but it happens. I, I got mad by the end. I am I'm hungry. I'm really hangry. Hangry is not a myth, it is real. And yeah, now I'm gonna go get some shit. I know it was shit, but it is 3.11 and this is the first thing I've eaten in over 24 hours. So basically I intermittently fasted, intermittent fasted, I fasted, I feel exhausted, <sighs> crazy, it was crazy yesterday obviously at the concert and didn't sleep that well, I did sleep but I didn't sleep enough actually, and I'm starving still and I'm tired and I'm thirsty and I'm everything and I just want to go home and start eating, and then later tonight, well, fuck you, uh, I'm going to, I'm really mad. Uh, later tonight, I'm gonna go and do cardio around 7 or 8 p.m. About an hour. No, yeah, about an hour. Probably 45 minutes for sure. And yeah, so, you know, like I was saying before, it happens. Not every workout's gonna be great, but I'm just upset that it was really bad and half assed and everything and sure as fuck. Okay, so I was also 0.4 lighter than my all-time low weigh-in, which was 148, one, no, no, 141.8. And now, this morning I was 141.4, so that's awesome. Can't wait to break into the 130s. Goal is 130 on the dot. Will I make it? Who knows? Do I think I will? Honestly, no. But I'm gonna push myself. But I kinda doubt it in the time I've given myself, but I'm not dieting any longer than the end of August. God, I am exhausted, guys, but that concert was life-changing. It's really up there with all the raves and other shit I've gone to in my life. Event-wise, it was amazing, so I really enjoyed it. Incredible. Great time with the friends. Great vibes, great everything. How you definitely, oh, so good. I, that's what I've been craving to do, to go to something like that, for like, ever since the last one, but none of them have been working out. And then right before I left uh, Greece, everyone like went on vacation, so I'm like, oh great. I fucking forgot to get the fucking VT rice. And I wanted to have rice today. Alright, so I'm gonna have the snickerdoodle dandy. It's supposed to be chunky, which is good, I love chunks. You have some Arctic Zeros that are 150 and some that are 300. I think 300 is perfect, and the macros aren't like Halo Tops which contain a lot of carbs, I think. I don't know how many carbs this have. Oh yeah, this doesn't have a lot of carbs, I think. I don't know, I might just be stupid. I'm eating it anyways, I put it in my macros, I'm eating it, and I'll let you know how good it is. And I think it's gonna be good, because this one, yeah, I didn't mind the other one. It was like the chocolate one, it was like hot cocoa. It just wasn't very strong a taste. It was very great, but this one should be good. 300 calories is fine. That wasn't bad. I liked it. I really did. Um, there was another one, or like maple syrup or some shit like that. I'll probably try it as soon as possible, but yeah, it was good. It wasn't crazy good. 
It's Arctic Zero. No, what do you expect? The Halo Tops are better. The Arctic Zero has better macros. So, and that did have a lot of carbs. Add forty-four carbs. Damn, dude, I knew it because it was three hundred calories and it's chunks. So I'm like, there has to be more um, carbs and shit than the normal one fifty per pint ones and. It did, but whatever. I don't mind. I don't feel like, oh, I wasted my macros on it. I think it was a good, good macro placement right here. I don't, I'm not mad or upset. Christ. Oh, God. Alright, so I added a lot of whipped cream. I have the chocolate walls and farms. And I added a lot of egg whites. That's why the waffles are like, eh. I'm not going for aesthetics, I'm going for volume, and yeah, I'm really hungry, and the Wi-Fi is out, so I'm pissed, so nothing to watch or consume media-wise while I eat this. That was really good. I'm going to nap now. I just ate food, so I'm pretty stuffed. Drink water. Kodiak waffles with uh, you know, a lot of egg whites and stuff. It's my thing now. Whipped cream on top. Ooh. I don't want to eat anything else because I do like to like listen to podcasts or watch something while I eat. It's just how I am. Or I like to eat with someone else. But I was like, oh, sit down with my little brother. And he just sat there. I'm like, all right, I like talking and eating with someone else. But um, yeah, whatever. I'm going to just relax right now. Right when I said that, the Wi-Fi came back. So... I wasn't thinking today I wanted to get Oreo fins or, you know, Chips Ahoy fins, but whatever, and rice, but I'm gonna... Finishing off my macros, num num num. Mmm. Getting lean, man. Mmm. So, I fit in three of those Oreo cookies, they're really good. And I'll show you my final thing I'm going to eat. And I am going to have another monster before I hit the gym tonight. So so this is a little bit less scrambled than I usually do. I am trying to make it not like that. And I'm, I'm learning as I go on. Alright, this is the final product. It didn't, the microwave could not fit that plate. It's too big. So I put a smaller plate and I just combined it and it like stacked it up. Cheese, everything, and this is some barbecue sauce. So I'm gonna enjoy this right now. Um, there's no girl I can't get, um, and there's no Wallen Farms that I don't like. I, I love every product. And I'm not sure if just I'm so deep in the cutting, but whatever. I love it. I'm gonna enjoy this. This is so not aesthetic. It looks like mashed potatoes. Yo, man, my new TV is hella nice. Look at this bad. Ooh, it's a Sony too. You know how big of a fanboy I am. I haven't even used it yet. This kid's been on it 24-7. But my room's looking nice. This TV's sexy. It's perfect setup going on right now. I love it. I don't know. I was thinking about getting a bigger bed, but I think maybe we'll see. I, th I think I will, but this is a nice ass TV and setup right now. Hooking up the PS4 and we're going to get the Wi-Fi up to speed. That's the game plan. Yo, we got another upgrade right here. We got my lamp for my room. And then we got these bad boys. I might use that fridge. I don't know how well it works. I love these suckers. Hey, man. I don't know what's going on. My old iPhone 6 Plus broke. So I was like, let me get two 6 Plus S's. 64 gigs. Hey, so gonna... I'm going to the gym now, get that cardio done, and Devin's gonna pick me up, FIFA tournament, shit we've been waiting for forever. I'm fucking shit up. Like, I might be eating that pepper.